to Ohio now where state investigators say there's no sign of any public health hazard after another one. A train derailment that happened on Saturday in the town of Springfield. This is west of Columbus. A driver sitting at the rail crossing captured on camera the first few seconds of that derailment. Unlike the accident in East Palestine, Ohio, none of the 28 cars that derailed here in Springfield contained any hazardous material. Now, just the same lawmakers from Ohio and elsewhere, they're raising questions about rail safety. USC engineering professor Najim Meshkati has been studying train safety for 30 years. He points to problems with the regulation of rail safety standards. We do a great job thanks to NTSB in accident investigation, but we don't do such a great job in following up and implementing those recommendations. Yeah, let's uh, let's do that. Rail companies say, uh, rail, ra rather, let me start again. Rail companies such as Norfolk Southern say, despite having fewer workers on trains, derailments have actually decreased in recent years.